Hello everyone, today I want to talk about the Plunder Bug Land Tab from Hack5, which I bought a couple of years ago and I successfully use it every time I want to capture the traffic between devices to which I don't have the logical access. Now, what I mean by that? You see, this device has two Ethernet ports and one USB-C. I can connect two devices on these Ethernet ports, and then I can capture the traffic between these two devices using the USB-C interface from this device. Let's try that. I have ISP cable from my lab that goes to one port. It doesn't matter which port it goes. And then I have router that goes to the other port. Now I can plug this device to the Windows and it will show up as an USB to Ethernet adapter. This is the Windows machine and I'm going to plug this cable and you will see that the Hack5 adapter has appeared. Now this name is custom name. I named it the interface this way so I can recognize easily. By default it will be Ethernet 2, 3 or depends what's the default name of your local area network interfaces on your system. It can work on Linux, on Mac, on Windows, it doesn't matter. All systems are supported. Now, if I go into Wireshark, I will be able to capture traffic between Unified Router and ISP using this adapter. Now, let's try that and start capturing the traffic. You see this ICMPS? This is Unified Ultra trying to understand if the ISP is reachable so that it can fail over to the other ISP interface if there is a configuration for that. This is how it recognizes if the ISP is reachable. This device can be plugged between any two Ethernet devices. It can be plugged between computer and phone, phone and switch, switch and router. Anytime you need to capture traffic on Ethernet interface and you don't have the access to that device or that device doesn't have the capabilities of capturing traffic. You can use that, capture the traffic, and then analyze to understand what's going on on the devices. That's it for today. Tell me what you think about this device.